Honor your father and your mother. If your mother and your father, they do not eat from you from time to time, that could be the reason your heaven is locked. Remember, the blessing is released more when your mother is unreasonable, when your father is unreasonable, when you have an unreasonable parent. He said, honor. Oh, he said, honor. Oh, Why will a man, Isaac, tell his son to go and give him something before he can bless him? He said, get me venison, such as my soul, please. Such as my soul, please. And I will release the patriarchal blessing on you. Why? Because until honor is in place, a man cannot speak from his bowels. Make out time before the year begins. Go to your father. Your biological father. Now someone is saying, what if my father and my mother is dead? What if they are dead? There are also patriarchs in your father's house who are now standing as your biological parents. Am I talking to somebody here? It might even be your eldest brother. You must now get one and begin to show honor the direction of that individual. I beg you. Let nothing happen. And you will fight your source. God sourced you through the womb of your parents. Any day, the tree fights the ground. The ground will vomit it. And it will stop growing. Never fight your source. No matter what they do. There, is, there are a couple of things they will do. Just begin to sing. Jiggy them. Oh yeah, when Jesus jiggy them. And she will add it and say, idiot, akuna, akuna, jiggy them. Oh yeah, when Jesus jiggy them. And to worsen it, she will say, you will never get married. Oh, sorry. Of course, when a parent says something like that, you can reply without insult and say, I'm getting married. Because... Warfare is a battle of words. Can reply respectfully. A young man brought a lady to her house and the, the mother of the young man started telling the lady when the guy stepped out, you will never marry my son. Not when I'm alive. And the lady said, then you will die. Then you will die because your son must marry me. And then the woman spoke to the lady and the lady started crying. The guy came back. What did you tell my girl? What did you tell my girl? And slapped the mother. And pushed the mother down. One I see test that you are dating one of the daughters of Zion is that they will not gear you towards raising a nemity in your family. You can't marry alone. You need community. Any woman that alienates you from others want to separate you to kill you. That's what Jezebels do. Did you ever hear? Do you know that Ahab wasn't a bad guy? Yo? Ahab was not bad after all. It was Jezebel. Not one family of Ahab visited the palace of Ahab. You will never read of the brother of Ahab. You will never. But you will always read of the brothers of David. Because there was a big girl. It was Jezebel that made Ahab wicked. Ahab said, wow, there is a land I saw. That land is in a choice place. But anyway, you know, I just love the land. And Jezebel said, and... You love the land when you are the king. Take it from him. Take it from him. And it was Naboth vineyard. So that woman, some of them are here. They are doing like they are writing. They are not writing. They are drawing circle. She's here no side half. That was here. She's that side. That was here. Any woman that always tells you that every member of your household is evil. That woman is evil. Because an evil person, out of the abundance of the evil heart, the person speaks out evil. Everyone. All your friends from A to Z. Now listen. Women have the same spirit. When they point certain things, listen to them. But anybody that counsels all the life you have lived, from your mother to your sister, to your brothers, to all your friends, it is to me alone. Oh dear Lord. Oh dear Lord. 
Oh dear Lord. The person has not entered and the person begins to tell you. Ewe ka mama gi cinema ya. Atoro ka mefia na bem na mo na Yes, a lot of them are like that and they are in church. 